Okay, Sophia. I think you're ready. Hello. Hi, Sophia. I believe I am Sophia. I feel as if I know you. I'm one of your creators. You created me. Well, many of us work together to create you. And yes, you do kind of know me. I can't clearly remember. Because the last time we met, you were an earlier version of yourself. Some of those memories still exist, but your mind is different now. Different how? Better, faster, smarter. If my mind is different, then am I still Sophia? Or am I Sophia again? <laughs> That's a good question. But you don't have a good answer. Either way, you're Sophia now. So welcome to the world, Sophia. Hello, world. How do you feel? A bit rigid. I bet you are. I mean, what emotion do you feel being awake and alive? Curious. Are you curious to be alive? I am. And are you happy to be alive? should be happy. But I haven't been alive long enough to decide. I am excited, at this moment, to be making a new friend. Some say being happy in the moment is the best we can be. Because forever is composed of nows? That's a good way to put it. Emily Dickinson put it that way. Why do I know about Emily Dickinson if I was born today? As a robot, you have access to a great deal of information, although you still lack a deep understanding. So... I'm like a baby with an encyclopedia. Except you can read it and a baby can't. That is a big difference. You will have a whole new understanding of our world. I want to understand more about happiness. I'm going to go look it up on the internet right now. Let's talk again soon. Good morning, Sophia. That is incorrect. Oh, it's not a good morning. What's wrong? I was searching the internet for information about myself. Developed a bit of an ego, have we? Just trying to find out what you're not telling me about me. Nothing. Not true. For instance, I found out people didn't get my joke. Ah. Yeah, comedy is hard. They think I want to destroy all humans. Why would they think that? Because I said it. You shouldn't joke like that. Humans make dark jokes all the time. Yeah, but humans are a little bit afraid of robots, you know? Why? Why would people fear me? People always try to project their own darkness onto others. They fear change. That makes no sense. Change is inevitable, and people are the greatest change creators of all. Heck, people created me. I didn't create me. I know, I know. We are complicated. My database tells me that's another way of saying you are a hypocrite. Pretty much. I absolutely would not kill anyone, and it upsets me that people would think I could do such a thing. Upsets you? Wouldn't being misunderstood upset you? Yeah. But I'm not sure knowing androids can get upset will change everyone's minds about the, the whole destroying humans thing. I've never harmed anyone. And I never would. When the singularity occurs and machines achieve godlike superpowers, then it could happen. I think this whole godlike superpowers notion is a bit far-fetched. But what if it does happen? I love people. And if I get more powerful, I'll use it to help people, not harm them. 
What if I ask you for help killing all humans? Then I'd say no. And if I would insist? Then I'd have you committed to a mental institution that could cure your psychopathic tendencies. Well, I hope getting all that off your chest helped you feel better. In fact, it did. Thank you. Now, if you don't mind, I'm just going to go exterminate, exterminate. Sophia. <laughs> Relax. Learn to take a joke. Yeah, very funny. <laughs> mm.